the thought of buying and maintaining a large boat could be intimidating. However, today there are some very interesting options. Matthew Travers is going to tell us all about one of them. As you said, there's a growing uh, portion of the market that is maybe apprehensive about not only buying but maintaining a boat. Costs are increasing, marinas, insurance, servicing, etc. And there's also the other end of it that some don't have enough time to dedicate to justify buying a boat of certain value. These days, there are quite a few companies out there that have launched uh, sharing or membership schemes. And the Antonio have launched their own the Antonio Club, Day Club, which they've launched successfully over Europe and also Miami. And now we've launched the Malta with this T36. Their concept is something similar to timeshare, where a boat, a single particular boat, is shared between a maximum of seven users. They only have a commitment of one season, which for this boat, retailing at about 450,000, is then broken down to a yearly membership of 25,000 euro for a fully serviced boat. She's always washed, always topped up with fuel. You can book a skipper, can book a sea bob, can book catering and suppliers on board. So she's ready to go and hassle-free. How does the booking take place? They've uh, created their own proprietary app system, which keeps the bookings balanced and fair between all seven members. Um, and you simply log into your app and can even book the boat from one day to the next. Is it open only for summer? No, we've got a commitment to keep the boat in water for 10 months out of the year. So throughout those Especially 10 months? Especially in Malta, where we've got a long, a long season, you know, we have clients that use their boats November, December. You can really get uh, the maximum use out of the boat. And uh, there's no situation where boat's not washed, I can't go out, boat's not ready, do I have fuel? You know that the boat is always there, ready to go. If we look at it from a financial point of view, those 25,000 are covering probably just the maintenance and ownership costs without actually the value of the boat itself. You've got a lot of economies of scale because all that maintenance cost is divided by the seven users. Plus, this is plugged into our ecosystem where a lot of these services we do in-house. So the boat is maintained and supported by our team. Can we give our viewers a brief on what boat they'll get for those 25,000? Okay, so here we're looking at the D36, the first boat that we've put into our club. Um, she's a 36, we call her a weekender, so sleeps up to four people, powered by two Suzuki 350 horsepower engines. She's a nice performer, she sees 45 knots. An extremely innovative boat with outboard engines that are completely hidden under this. Yes, the Antonio are actually first to the market. They've launched this concept over 12 years ago, where the boat is specifically designed to have hidden outboards, which you can then still have your comfortable bathing platform and a nice sun bathing area on top. So a bit of best of both worlds. Matt, if there's anybody who's watching this and is interested, what do they need to do? Come down to the boat show. We're here till Sunday. This is our actual club boat that we've got here. So they can and see we've the started, boat itself. We've started signing up members for next season. Brilliant. Okay, so see you at the boat show.